As one of the youngest members of the Kardashian family, Kendall Jenner has been in the spotlight for years. Although she originally gained fame as one of the youngest members of the Kardashian family, Kendall has solidified her success over the years as a supermodel, social media influencer, and an excellent entrepreneur. Her career has come with so much backlash with some saying she's grossly overpaid for her lackluster energy simply because of her name, and others saying she's a cold and an apathetic person, and other people blame her for the deftoned Pepsi advert she was in. As with everything, there's always two sides of the story, and I don't really think that she's a bad person. Regardless of how you feel about her, I think that we can't let personal dislikes and biases seep in if we're objectively judging looks. So we can all agree that she is very beautiful. So in this video, we'll discuss Kendall Jenner's glow-up guide that took her from this to this and determine if it's worth a try. Gua Sha is the first step in Jenner's morning skincare regimen. She preps her face using virgin coconut face oil and rose water. She uses a chilled Gua Sha tool to address her lymphatic system situation. Next, she diligently washes the oil off her face with Jan Marini Bioglycolic Face Cleanser. She then gives her lips some TLC next, using the Kylie Cosmetics lip butter that she can't get enough of. Her softening steps continue with La Mer Moisturizing Cream. Then, after a thorough application of LTMD SPF and a refreshing spritz of Caudalie Beauty Elixir Face Mist. For her maintenance, she does PRP microneedling, and she also uses serums. For her makeup routine, she loves doing a natural glowing skin makeup. She uses her fingers to apply Chanel foundation because it makes her look more natural. Then she applies her L'Oreal Paris concealer and uses a sponge to blend it in. Next, she does her contour using her iconic contour stick from her and Kylie's collection. She tops it off with more cream bronzer, the Charlotte Tilbury's cream bronzer. She uses it especially for her nose contour and her eyes. She then takes the small end of her brush and uses the same contour for her eyeshadow. She loves blush as you can tell and the one she uses is Kylie Cosmetics Cream Blush. She then highlights her cheeks using the L'Oreal Paris Lumi Glotion. Then, it's time to brush out her brows using Anastasia's Tried and True Pencil. While she's trimmed her brows in the past, her motto these days is to leave them really natural. One of her brows is shorter than the other so she uses a brow pencil to add its length. She then uses pressed powder all over her face. She also uses some powdered bronzer to give her a soft glow. Also, she uses powdered blush to tie the look together. She calls her eye makeup the least skilled part of her routine, so she aims to keep the look simple. She dabs on some matte brown eyeshadows from a L'Oreal Paris palette. She uses the browner tones because they work really well for her, and she stays away from a shimmery eye. For her eyelashes, she curls them to give them more length. She then slicks them with the L'Oreal Paris Panorama Mascara. For her final touch, Kendall decides to test out an undone red lip with French Girl vibes. Using a method she saw on TikTok, she applies a red lipstick without using lip liner. She then uses her finger to smudge out the red lipstick she's applied. When it comes to fragrance, Kendall opts for scents that are chic, modern, and versatile. One of her favorite perfumes is C by Giorgio Armani. This iconic fragrance features notes of blackcurrant, rose, and vanilla, creating a captivating and sensual aroma that perfectly complements Kendall's understated yet glamorous style. In addition to C, Kendall Jenner has also been known to favor fragrances that are fresh, clean, and unisex. She's often seen wearing Molecule 01 by Eccentric Molecules. This fragrance embodies Kendall's laid-back sophistication and is a staple in her perfume collection. Let's get to her workout routine. Kendall was born with good genes and is naturally slim. Despite that, she is really dedicated to her fitness. She's flaunted her physique on Instagram on the regular and is known to frequent high-intensity gym classes with kickboxing being her favorite exercise and even working on her deadlifting. But when it comes to working out at home, her approach is surprisingly accessible and not as hardcore as you'd think. Even if you're not particularly fitness obsessed, this is the 11-minute workout Kendall Jenner swears by and it will get you right. Step 1. Forearm plank for 30 seconds. For this one, you just need to get down in the push-up position. But instead of propping yourself with your hands, bend your arms at your elbows so all your weight is on your forearms. Clench your abs and glutes and make sure your body stays straight. Step 2. High plank for 30 seconds. Similar to the first step, get down in the push-up position, 
but stay up on your hands making sure they are aligned with your shoulders. Step 3. Side Plank for 15 seconds. Start on one side with your forearm propping you up. Keep your feet together and stacked on top of each other and repeat on each side after holding for 15 seconds. Step 4. Side Plank with Crunch, 5 reps each side. As the name would suggest, this involves performing slow crunches while balancing in a side plank. Starting off in the same position as the side plank, with hips off the ground and your top hand behind your head. Bend your top leg and raise it to meet the bent elbow of the hand behind your head. Do this five times for each side. Step five, alternating arm and leg plank for 15 seconds. Starting off in a high plank, bring your knee up to your elbow on the same side while keeping your back flat and core tight. Step six, rocking plank for 15 seconds. Moving back into the forearm plank position, rock your body forward so that you're coming up onto the tips of your toes. Roll back to the original position and repeat. Step seven, knee to elbow plank, five reps on each side. Starting off in a high plank, bring your knee up to your elbow on the same side while keeping your back flat and core tight. Step eight, standard crunch for 20 reps. Lying flat on your back, on a comfortable floor, with feet flat on the ground and knees bent, hip width apart, place your hands behind your head and lift your upper body up. Make sure you're not straining your neck and instead are engaging your core. Step nine, bicycle crunch for 30 seconds. Starting off in the same crunch position, Extend your legs straight out before bending one knee up towards your head and bringing the opposite elbow down to touch the bent knee. Repeat on the other side. Step 10, vertical crunch for 20 seconds. Similar to a crunch only, keeping your bent legs together instead of hip width apart, you're going to lift your entire upper body up off the ground using your abdominal muscles. Step 11, frog crunch for 15 reps. Lying on your back with your hands behind your head, Place your legs in a diamond or frog shape so that the soles of your feet are flat together. Then comes the hard part, trying to both lift your upper body and bring your knees up to your chest at the same time. This one's a little trickier, so don't worry if it's not perfect. Step 12, twisted crunch for 15 reps. Starting flat on your back, lift your legs off the ground with a 90 degree bend at your knees with hips parallel to the floor. Using your abdominal muscles, twist your upper body to the left so your right shoulder and elbow are turning toward your left knee. Return to the original position and try out with the other side. Step 13, leg lifts, 15 on each leg. Lie on the ground with legs straight and together and arms at your sides, palms facing down. Slowly raise one leg to a height that feels comfortable and then lower back down and repeat with the other leg. A hectic schedule filled with runway shows, traveling and business meetings makes it very challenging for Kendall to maintain her health and fitness. Her solution is to keep things simple by going for fresh and organic foods. Let's take a closer look at Kendall Jenner's diet plan and determine if it's worth a try. When it comes to food, Kendall doesn't follow a specific diet, but she generally sticks to whole grains, lean meat, and veggies. To keep her skin clear, she avoids too much dairy and drinks plenty of water. She is also admitted to drinking as many as 12 cups of detox tea a day. Here's a glimpse of what Kendall Jenner usually eats on a daily basis. Breakfast oatmeal, avocado, eggs, lunch, lean chicken, brown rice, dinner, salad, sushi, vegan spaghetti, or pizza, snacks, tortilla chips, carrot sticks, or a Twix bar, drinks, kiwi, strawberry, snapple, tea, and water. In an interview, Kendall revealed that she eats frozen yogurt twice a week. She treats herself to high-calorie foods like fried chicken, pizza, but only in moderation. Even though Kendall Jenner has provided details about her diet and exercise plan in interviews, there are no official specific guidelines on how to follow her diet. Therefore, it's not the best option if you prefer structured plans with detailed guidance. If you have a difficult time moderating your intake of these foods, you may find the plan challenging, as it allows processed foods like pizza, pasta, and sweets. Finally, Jenner has noted in some interviews that she drinks up to 12 cups, 2.8 liters, of detox tea per day. Although it's unclear which type of detox tea she drinks, some varieties contain caffeine or laxatives, which could be harmful in high amounts. If you want to steal Kendall Jenner's easygoing yet polished model off-duty style, try adding these items to your wardrobe. Straight leg jeans. Kendall's style always consists of well-fitted medium wash straight leg jeans. Crop tops. An easy pairing with your straight leg jeans would be a crop top. Kendall wears these frequently to help balance out some of her more oversized and baggy pieces. Leather pants. This year we have seen Kendall Jenner rocking a lot of leather pants. 
She wears both fitted and straight leg leather pants, mostly in brown and black. Flip-flop heels or strappy sandals. Kendall's style has been evolving over the years, and her latest shoe choice seems to be flip-flop heels or simple strap sandals. They are simple and trendy, so they pair well with a lot of other pieces. Keep jewelry minimal. Kendall isn't known for bold jewelry choices. With the exception of a few evening looks, she keeps her jewelry very minimal. Try a simple gold link necklace or a pair of standard gold hoops. Sunglasses. These happen to be very popular this year, so it's no surprise Kendall has so many pairs of them. Leather blazer or a coat. Kendall loves a great leather jacket. We have seen her style everything from a leather trench, blazer, and oversized leather jacket. So don't be afraid to try the leather blazer trend. Shoulder bags. Baguette style bags have been her most worn handbag, so definitely add a simple 90s style shoulder bag to keep your outfit Kendall inspired. Cropped white tank. We already discussed her love of crop tops in general, but I would be remiss to not mention how often she wears cropped white tanks. They are versatile, pair well with everything, and are a great foundational outfit piece. Knee-high boots. She loves pairing knee-high boots with long denim shorts or even with a casual dress. They are great for your proportions and can give your outfit a polished finishing touch. In her early years in the public eye, Kendall sported a youthful and natural look, characterized by her distinct features. However, as her modeling career soared and her influence grew, Subtle shifts in Kendall's appearance began to catch the public's attention, fueling rumors of plastic surgery and cosmetic interventions. Among the most talked about procedures associated with Kendall Jenner are nose jobs and rhinoplasty, breast augmentation, Botox and fillers and lip injections. Speculations about brow lifts and eye surgeries have also circulated, with some suggesting that Jenner may have undergone procedures to lift and reshape her eyebrows and eyelids. While subtle changes in Jenner's brow and eye area have been noted by fans, the extent of any surgical interventions remains speculative. Kendall has consistently denied undergoing plastic surgery, yet her evolution over the years has sparked speculation. Fans have debated whether her features are natural or the outcome of cosmetic procedures. Tell me what you think about this in the comments. Is she lying or is she truthful?